Hey everybody, I'm Stu Carter from Atomai TV. If you know me, you know that I am a professional toy tester. I operate a top secret toy testing laboratory. I'm a military industrialist. I advise the United States military on which toys can be converted to military use. Things like that. And uh, many people ask me, many kids ask me in the comments, they say, Stu, where do you get your toys from? Do the companies give you the toys free? Actually, in most cases, no. I go out and I purchase them so that I know exactly I'm getting exactly the kind of toys that you're getting. See, I'm getting just that. I'm, I'm using my own money, whatever I've got. I've got a little bit of money here. See, I've got a little bit. Of, I've got a little bit of money, and I go and I use my little bit of money to buy toys. Sometimes not. For instance, just the other day, a mysterious box appeared while well, a man knocked on my door carrying. A mysterious box, a parcel. I was not expecting this. And on checking the manifest, the manifest, that's the shipping documents, that's all this stuff with uh, FedEx. The manifest, it said, it's coming from Jazzwares in Florida. Shotgun Road, Florida. <laughs> Sunrise, Florida. Jazzwares. You know Jazzwares? Jazzwares, they're not the biggest company. They're not, they're not Hasbro or Mattel, but they're a pretty big company. I'm sure you see their toys in stores, right? Jazzwares, completely unexpected, more or less. So I open this mysterious box, and I find inside another mysterious box. Who makes a black box? I mean, it's a, it's a real black box. You've heard of black boxes? This is obviously a black box. So I open the box. I open it up. It's full of toys. It's full of toys. Ah. Uh, Completely free. They just send me toys. What are they? I will, sh I will show you. I will show you the toys. I will show you. You want me to take them out? I'll tell you in advance. I'll tell you they're Minecraft toys. Here. Let's get a close-up look. Let's take them all out. One at a time. I'll show them to you. Okay, so here we go. The first one. Wow, it's a Stevie figure. And these are large. Because I've been, I, my son Alex and I have uh, talked about the blind box minifigures before for Minecraft. These are the largest ones I've seen. It says a Stevie, and he got some accessory there. A piece of the mine, apparently, right? Because that's Minecraft. Stevie. And here's an Alex. I do not know Alex. My son's name is Alex. You know why I called him, why I named him Alex? Because of Alexander the Great. Because I hoped that someday he might be, well, I don't know, if as great as Alexander. But maybe it would inspire him to do great things. Yeah, anyway, I, I, my name is Stu Stewart. I was named after a Confederate cavalry general, Jeb Stewart, from the Civil War. <laughs> but I digress. Uh, pig man, pig man, <laughs> pig man. Yeah, these are large, aren't they? And then, okay, and then, and then uh, Alex again with skeleton horse. Look how large it is. And I guess he can ride the horse. Look at that. There's a picture on the back. Well, he sits on it anyway. Wow. And, oh, they're falling off. And here's a, a, a larger set. Alex, survival pack. So he's got several tools. I assume these are things that he acquires or you acquire in the game to survive. Let me see if it says on the back all the, well, you, I'll figure it out because I'm not going to review these today. But I noticed there's a, also a picture of all the other things that you can get. Charge Creeper, Zombie Pigman, Alex in Diamond Armor, Stevie with Minecraft, and Witch. Hmm, it says collect them all. So these are new. These are just coming out. Uh, I understand. And uh, finally, this one says uh, Wild Animal Pack. <laughs> so you get all the weird, you get all the weird animals. You can see them, right? You get all the weird animals. It says polar bear, moose room, black sheep, hostile wolf, ocelot. What is an ocelot? I think an ocelot is a kind of a cat. Is it not in Africa or in the jungle somewhere? Maybe in Asia. And then there's a bat. Interesting. See, there's a little bit of data. See, that's I, knew, I didn't know these. I, I was just <laughs> I'm reading the back because I don't know Minecraft that well. My son has to tell me about it. I count on him. These are authentic. They've got the Jazzware logo. This is for real. These must be new stuff coming out that's just coming on the shelf. You guys tell me in the comments if you've seen this yet. 
uh, on the shelves in your stores locally. Or maybe you haven't, but maybe it's coming. It says Series 3 on this one. Yeah, Series 3. So uh, I guess they sent these out before. Now they're sending me Series 3. Well, let me tell you something. I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. Oh, since Stu gets these toys free, I guess he could be bought. His opinions are for sale. No, no, no. I'm going to come over this desk at you. No, no. I'm a professional. I'm a professional. I owe it to you to give you my solid baseline opinions. I'm not like certain other toy reporters. You know, there's some people who get stuff free. They don't tell you about it, even though there's a federal law that says they're supposed to tell you. No, and you know, there's also certain sleaze balls who gets who get paid to say nice things about their games. Guys like PewDiePie. Yeah, he's a sleaze ball. He is a sleaze ball. He gets paid. People are paying them to say nice things about a game that you you pay six sixty or seventy dollars to play. Anyway, no, I'll give a straight up. We'll do a review on these. I'll give my straight up opinion. But in fact, in fact, with modern toys, because I've been playing with toys a long time modern toys for the most part are of excellent quality i hardly ever have a problem sometimes there's problems with the big play sets with electronic ones that move and stuff those sometimes have problems but basic toys action figures it's just your opinion on you know how nice they look and stuff otherwise there's never a, i hardly ever see a defect in toys these days so we got that going for us but i promise you i owe it to you to give you my straight up honest Reviews every time, always, forever. So stand by for more of these. And coming up next, I'm going to talk about uh, some toy loot I got from out in the wilderness, in the jungle. There'll be some, there'll be some Benton, there'll be some Beyblades, there will be some uh, Battle Strikers. So look for that. And until next time, have a great day. Kill me, I guess I'm doing okay I'm lost, I'm lost Among the men